Uh, uh, oh, wait, what's that? There we go! <laughs> Oh, God damn. Oh, good morning. Better than I was yesterday. Not overtired. Uh, but I know I am unfortunately sharing uh, the bandwidth with my two children. They are fucking, uh, they're watching the, on the smart TV. Um, my friends Winnie and, and Pooh, that old um, Disney Junior show. Uh, anyway, uh, yesterday I kind of was doing this. Uh, wait, wait, I forgot the game saved. I, I should have a save. Hold up. What? Oh, what bullshit! The game didn't save. The game did not save. What? What? Oh, something's not right. Hold up. Sim folder. Cam data. Da, da. Oh, that's a. That's a. Oh yeah, no, that's a. What's the name? It's The uh, what's the name? Six. Uh, they are relentless. I really do got a what's the name? Uh, I don't know. It's not the item. Trying to think, uh, trying to really think of what the hell. Oh, bro, I don't really have anything that to test, uh, whether or not the the flash saving. Cause I know for a fact that uh, Nixon and Paradox Relic does have like a save functionality. Cause when you uh, when you buy the game off of the itch.io page, it literally is. Uh, you get like, hold on. I um, know I'm not going crazy. I know I'm not. All right, so version one nine. Oh, okay. Hmm. Of course. Of fucking course. All right. One second as I angle this. Such horseshit, but it is what it is, I guess. Um, ah oh man, that sucks. Ah oh man, oh yeah, and I better get the uh filter up on the uh capture card. See, I made like a simple like crop pad filter, kind of frees up like screen real estate in a way. But at least when I'm on the... Uh, it does work a little bit better. 
my opinion. Alright. Oh, luckily I think I mean... What's the nice save state I mean? I think this one? Yep, here we are. Boing. Um, now I bet anyone that has probably, that has seen probably some of my other streams is looking at this and going like, Mage, what the fuck are you doing? Uh, first and foremost, I'm literally just a, I'm gonna be honest when I say the following. Growing up, I always had the last generation console. I was born in 94 and even by the time uh but by, by the time I was like three like this is 98 and I'm like I was literally still playing an NES I wouldn't get a newer console until like say till 99 like the summer of no, it was either December of 98 or 99, I forgot exactly when, but I do remember like my, when I was 5, I had an, an NES front loader, uh, I had a Super Nintendo, I, I'm not sure which variant, I think it was like an original model, um, and then I also owned a Model 1 Genesis. Now to anyone that's just here and all this, y'all, uh, you're just probably going, What the fuck are you talking about? I'm talking about shit that nowadays, like, I know this shit isn't really the most advanced, but the thing that always amazed me now, uh, when I play older game, retro games is how much creativity you can get a, put into, like, these this old hardware if you're willing to put the time in. You know? Think of it like this, like... I, I was talking about Nestmaker in the last stream, and truth be told, Nestmaker was something that I, I did back on the Kickstarter, but it just made me... I wanted to create games and I still dabble I mess around with Nest Maker from time to time and I'm learning it as I do it and the thing I've I've seen and what really what really um kind of makes me impressed with the homebrew scene on the uh, for retro consoles is the fact these are consoles that had significant, really, really, really hard-lined limitations. I can't enable a scan line filter on the AVS, I don't think. But let's just say, like how it is on this entire screen. Um can only have on a horizontal line eight eight sprites not background tiles eight sprites in the foreground so like if there were eight sprites on the horizontal line You know, eight sprites on a horizontal line, meaning essentially, if there were like, let's say, nine sprites on a on the horizontal line, on a horizontal uh, line, there would be flicker.
you know. Even then, the slowdown that happens every now and then on these older systems was just because there was so much on the screen that the CPU, the the, the CPU couldn't handle it. Because if you keep that in mind, like what these older consoles were, they were just, in all honesty, just retro. Just for the time, like uh. Glorified computers in a way. Uh, <laughs> oh, fuck. I think I remember the first time I saw that, that caught me off guard. Um, the Super Nintendo and really all older system home consoles were at the time just glorified uh, PCs that just over time uh, adapted to like the changes in hardware because we stop and think about it uh, the NES has what's the name has uh, NES has like a CPU, a picture processing unit, and what's just called what it's like the the if I really had to bring modern terms, computing terms, just think like the CPU is of course central processing unit. And anyone that dabbles in PCs should already know about that and should already have an idea what that is. Essentially the brain of the entire thing that reads all the code and goes this does this this does that Oh god, I forgot if I had to go through here I am going insane now Um so Basically, the NES had like an 8-bit processor, which I think was a common thing for like early computing back then. I'm not entirely, like, not off the top, man, I can't say with 100% confident. Fuck. I forgot if I had to even go down there. I think I do because. Um, or maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Uh, I spoke to Kronos. Um. Oh, one more try and then I'm literally gonna start roaming around. Oh god! Dead. I think- No, now I think I remember. I have to go up. Around? Yes. Yes. Ah! Uh -huh. Yeah, what that was. Just impressed. Like, if I had to guess, this is using. I don't know what 
module in Nesmere group this is using. Uh, first thing that comes in mind is I think I want to say the uh, Metroidvania module, but I don't think so. Off the top of my head, I don't want to say that 100%. It's like. I'm not entirely certain, and it's actually bothering me to some degree. Fuck! Help me! Oh! I could farm for lives. Ah, oh, this sucks. <laughs> no. Oh no. Um. Anyway. Uh. Save. Oh, thank God. Finally. Actual life. Ah! Ah! Eh. Ah, my fucking fingers! Arthritis is a bitch. Fuck. Uh... slowdowns happening on this screen as far as I can see like the only oh fuck oh fuck oh fuck what the hell <laughs> target back is turned pop cap Oh, thank God. Not that far back. Save. Ah! Ah, ow. Not gonna complain. <laughs> Not gonna complain. <laughs> God damn, that's funny. Fuck her right off the screen. <laughs> Must kill! Wait, where are you going? Why can't I turn around? Curse you! <laughs> Why has my creator done this to me? Whoa! Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That, that chain of music caught me off guard for a sec. The chain of music caught me off guard. Fuck. Oh, God. I am on my last life. This is a... No. Nope. Ah, uh, it's because of the way the the thing is. Nyx actually does kind of like the. Ah, oh, there we go. It wasn't the so far the sprite that fucked with me. It was just the change in music, just sudden. Like here, try hearing. This shit? Um... What's well, saying, and you hear the boss theme just sharply coming in. It's just... Jarring. It's like a... Like I just got punched right in the jaw. Uh, recording data. 
I only have one life. This sucks. Saves come with save states. One second. Ah, yes. It's, uh, da, 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 second. Need to find us some poor sucker to kill. Hey! You'll do! You'll do. No, 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 no! In a heart. Ah! Nothing. God damn it. Ah, oh, this is what I hate about randomized fucking pickups. Is that the random generator just fucks with me? Ah! <laughs> Alright, back to the fucking medical kernel thing. Yay! Wish I could take more than just three hits. Oh god, my fingers. If you weren't getting something out of these points, I really always saw them as this, like, I know there are, like, scoreboard sites, and the like, like, I still remember my experience with, like, posting a score on, uh, Twin Galaxy. Like, I recorded playing, um, fucking Shock Troopers off of, uh, off of a MBS flash card. 
got this hide score posted up. One of the people on the fucking thing said my score wasn't genuine. It was. It should be unemulated. It, it was. It was because because it was a fucking flash cart. I was playing on an Omega MVS unit, and to those that don't know what that is, that's just basically a consoleized MVS. Um, and I was just playing the game like I should. Doing good. I actually, if I remember, I think I scored enough to beat the the current holder, and that's what pissed me off. Like, dude was literally on a tear. He even wanted to see about getting the uh, the uh, current holder of the high score uh for shock troopers on the MBS. His score move because it was on a flash card, not an official cartridge. Like, bro, are you fucking kidding me? You tried finding a legitimate MBS cart in this in this day and age in this day and age for a damn affordable, decent price. Like, I get authenticity, but even on like Twin Galaxies, they accept Everdrives being used. And what I and what me and the guy used were basically just the Neo Geo equivalent of an Everdrive. They were flash cards. Like the thing is, nowadays, retro gaming is a hobby that is I'm honestly gonna be upfront with any, anyone watching. It's a hobby that's utterly fucking expensive. If I had to get into cost for a lot of this stuff, you would it would it would make your mind just go this it why do I do it? Like there are ways you can uh kinda make it affordable, but it depends on what you're willing to give up. If you want the convenience of being able to like play a game outright, be able to read the language, all that then you can easily probably find a decent price import card or so. God damn it. This is the thing I hate about this boss is literally he just he does not know the meaning of personal space. No, I think I need to jump. Trying until I went to succeed. I don't know, man. I'm honestly just gonna say it like if you get your hands on a clean console, maybe a flash draw, a uh, flash card. Play games however you play these old games however you want. Emulate them, fucking clone hardware emulation, software emulation, it doesn't really make a difference. And I honestly feel like you should be anything you do in the game should be valid regardless of what how you do it. No, it jumped. I think I did enough damage. Uh, uh. I, 
think what's funny is like I call myself a variety streamer, but that's because I'm really more I'm gonna be upfront and very honest. Like, I truthfully like using um uh, my live stream as a means of like being able to get like footage. Mainly to kind of just get a live recording done. With minimal like it does still take up space like I'm not gonna lie and say oh the VOD is nothing no the VOD is like an hour VOD still can take up gigs it's more I want to be I'm more of a I wanted to get more of like the video editing side of side of content creation uh the hang out of a uh, hang up like I wanted to practice my uh, video editing skills. <sighs> oh, God. I just said fuck it, I'm not I'm not playing this jumpy game bullshit. Another bracer, trying to your legs feel more powerful. Your kicks can now break fragile walls and glass. Hell yeah. Extra lives and wait. They respawn! Oh. The right. Another save state. Uh, but seriously though, like. I'm honestly just gonna say, and look up his talk about, and, like, why am I not constantly finding, like, a niche and sticking to it? I kind of just jump into what I want to play. Like, I've always felt like more burnout sticking to, even if it's in the same type of niche, I've always felt a burnout committing to it in a way. Like, I felt more comfortable just finding something I wanted to show off and going with that than finding something like the thing I uh, I normally stream and going off that. So I decided to just be more the way I'm approaching my streams. It's like this. I'm doing live recording. And the engagement part besides interacting with chat I'm working on commands with StreamerBot, and also I will say this, uh, for StreamerBot, for anyone, uh, I gotta check, because StreamerBot does check for, like, persistent viewers, anyone that's, like, on the persistent viewers list, uh, uh not persistent, but present viewers, uh, there is like a currency point system going on. And, but I might start making those things more like, might get rid of some of the, what's name, the uh, point currency requirements. Or at least kind of like disabling them. And 
then re-enabling them down the line. I don't know. But I honestly just... Oh, oh, wait, that was a ship. Fuck. I'm back at the... Oh, shit, I just realized I'm back at the very beginning. The first area. Oh, God. That, that, that was like, what the fuck is that? And then I forgot. Oh, God, no, that's a ship. That is a starting area. Holy crap. I'm in the beginning of the game. And it just... It's shit like that that pretty much makes me go, holy crap, this is... This is nuts. Um, now that we can break the actual, uh, fret, uh, fragile, now that we can break glass, well, there's actually a couple of... Um, there are a couple things we can actually... Ram. Fuck! Being a designer this area or one of the early ones? I'm trying to think off the top of my head. Uh, going looking around. If I see a glass, if I see glass, I kick. That's the holding salt. Yep. Oh lord, what kind of thing I really am. Interesting, I just broke something. Alright. Oh, yeah, now I can actually get this, uh, extra life because I can break the glass. Nice. There's something else. I'm trying to think. But it's eluding me. Like... Thank you. 
goddamn blank. I'm drawing a fucking blank. <laughs> uh, I'm literally trying to remember my brain. It's like a dial-up phone right now. <laughs> like seriously. My brain is a dial-up modem right now. It is just... <laughs> it's just going... <laughs> For God, if there... Was there actually anything else I meant? Uh... If this is, uh, North Sully? Um... Okay. No! 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 Fuck! Alright. Uh. Hold up. No. I'm going through all this again. Jump. Oh crap, I think I realized my mistake. One sec. I realized my mistake and it was too late. Oh, 
Oh, I don't have a reason. Quick change of a test. This calls for days. You asshole. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. Why? I better get some of that. Oh, damn. Give me something. No, no, I didn't want to go back down. I wanted to go. I wanted to. Thank you. Ah, uh, you motherfucker. You motherfucker. Hey, uh, hey, right. That was not. That was. Uh, Ted, she, she, okay. Interesting. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. I. I see. Oh. I'm sorry if I sound like a, I, I'm, I'm a child right now. Yo, I have not. I have not gotten this. Like my entire time playing, I've not gotten this at all. I played this game before made it to this exact point of uh, beat the third pirate and now it's like what the fuck do I do now I can't move I can't go north because I can't survive long enough and I never thought about it and uh, what's this find a bracer nice uh, break this shit thank you Ooh. All legends, thank you. Ooh. Okay. Okay. You just had to love Easter egg rooms like this. You just gotta. Anyway, uh. Hearts, baby. Uh, another razor. I'm starting to feel. I'm starting to see some. Kill the art, don't steal the Ogman braces or you're fired. That's some real corporate type shit right there. Don't steal the s- Think if I'm right, this is the uh, northern... What's the name? Ow. 
We ah. Oh yeah. That could X. Neat. as well. We're getting, we're making progress.
Oh god, come on! How many times do I... Just... Stop. I think I went the wrong way. Wrong way. Oh god, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh crap, I'm not making it. Okay, so I had to beat him again. There it is. I think that's the game. Oh, oh. not I think so. Oh wow, that was, that was it! Damn! Aw oh, man. Alright, so it doesn't go immediately back to the tile screen, you gotta reset the game. Oh wow! Never beat the game, but I'm pretty sure there was something extra I had to do, like, actually 
explore and find a uh, collectible or something. There are like some things going on. Uh, all right. I'm a BRB and then I'll be right. Uh, probably load up another game.
right, back. Uh, got the next game all nice and loaded, and it's the Adventures of Panzer. Another Nest Maker game that I own. I finally got the rest of the Nest Maker games that I own. I bought uh, up and going. Oh fuck! I forgot I had it. I was watching something on YouTube. Forgot to fucking stop it. <laughs> Uh, but this is definitely another game that kind of was interesting. The graphics oh, are, I'm gonna warn people, they are simplistic as fuck. I'm not joking. But, again, that that's the glory part about this. Like, I'm gonna feel like the whole idea <laughs> I love this. The, the portraits. The fucking uh, Minotaur du Blarg. Detailed, but our character, our tiny little spring boy. <laughs> Motherfuckers, it's. <laughs> I love this. Clark, really, man? It's time for another important mission. <sighs> that was ca- Oh god, I feel bad for Clark. Oh wow, bullied by a little sprite boy. Oh god, yes. <laughs> Panther looks so out of place. Nope, not completely out of place. Mostly out of place. Not proud. You can just not. God. Panther, reading is for chumps. <laughs> oh god, I love this, and I know this is damn well using the, um, fucking, what's name, the, the, uh, Metroidvania module. Or, yeah, cause we can scroll backwards. I tried! <laughs> oh! Oh! Bandit in a wheelchair! Bandit in a wheelchair! I- uh, I do- I feel- I am bullying the- I'm bullying a disabled bandit! That's not fun! What the fuck?! Oh, no! 
Don't cancel me, it's the way the game is! Fuck! Oh god, that's just... Per er, that was just perfect. <laughs> And we fight him again and again! He's like the mini-boss for the entire uh, first stage. It's hilarious to me. We're fighting a bandit who's in a wheelchair. Huh? Sup, brah? Why do you have a tractor in the middle of the game? I know I can't do anything because the B button uh, is also the talk button. For this case, god damn it, dude. Okay, got an extra delight. I really can't wait for a retro game for to come out, which is the next-ish version of Nest Maker. Axe. Oh, fuck. I can't throw any more axes, but I can just see. <laughs> Why is he in a wheelchair? Why? Oh. I'm feel right. <laughs> I feel that is just plain me. That's just plain oh They don't get it. It's making me fight a bandit that's in a wheelchair. I'm fighting a I am fighting a cripple and it's just a boss. Thinking a game over. Just old school games. This is how it was, believe it or not. A lot of games were like this, where there was no real, uh, it was cheaper to make. Okay, I'm actually gonna just say it was easier to make a game with, uh, not really a save functionality. Maybe continue? Because 
Yeah, <laughs> I don't even know. This game should have had something. <laughs> I don't want to keep tape state, man. I can easily just not complain as much when I'm playing an NES game. Says volumes of my, my, my childhood. Like, this, um, the NES was my childhood. Like, I'm not an 80s kid. It was just a handover from, um, when I grew up. My, uh, Mother still had the what's name? Had had the had like the NES with Mario Brothers. Um, and it was just something that stuck. Like I, I love playing retro games, and to an extent, I was kind of like the kid that had the hand-me-downs in a way, like the like. I had an NES, my cousins had Super Nintendos, uh, the PS1, the N64, uh, I knew one of the neighbors had, like, a Sega Saturn, and even, uh, another neighbor had Dreamcast. I want to get a modern console that was around, like, six, seven-ish? Round, roundabout? When I when I I got my PS2. Oh man, I remember playing that. Oh god. Sorry for the sorry for the flash for a second. I had to heal. I don't have anything I want to say that's not going to get me in a, a bunch of hot water because essentially I just, I just kicked the shit out of, <laughs> out of a band in the wheelchair. Say what you want, it's still a person and it's a fictional character and today many motherfuckers have stopped associating fiction and reality. Like, I don't even know anymore where I was going with that. I had an idea of where it was going, it, and it just went. Oh, wait, fuck! It arcs! Ah! Rock, you asshole! I wasn't drinking anything, any W, or I think I just spit take.
Alright, I'm definitely gonna have to say say. Uh, oh wow, I, I just remembered that I have. Uh, I can't heal through stupid. Oh wow. I like the lore. I like our main character is just fucking glorified. That's. I'm sure of myself! He, he is a, an idiot. He's an idiot. He really is. But it's just fucking no. What the fuck? No! Ah! Oh. You fucking! I gotta change the English state. One second. This is because the, to, to the developer of this, of this game. I know I'm late to the party. You're an asshole. Fuck. Don't. 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 He could have just had something. Even if I went to chest, I just press B. He could have just been a talk like an NPC saying, "There's nothing." Uh, it's locked or some shit, and Panzer just says, Fuuuuck. God damn it. I got tricked. My, my, <laughs> my simplistic thinking what, when sees treasure chest loot, my loot goblin, my inner loot, my inner goblin just kicked off and was like, Must get, must get treasure inside treasure box. <laughs> no, there ain't. It's just a prop. The bullshit. <laughs> uh... Oh god! What the fuck? Ah!
There. a game you can easily just do it with just the base modules and like like even the tutorials help you set up a simplistic game and then after you're done setting it up and playing it that's it that's that's basically the, the, the game itself but if you want to do complex stuff it requires coding it requires learning assembly stream some modern games uh, tomorrow. Uh, probably might stream some Prime Boss for Rock City. Because uh, Update 11 did drop and I'm probably going to have to redo my entire run, but, but we'll see. 